At 14 months old, Marshall Bowling seems a happy little boy. Brush your teeth. Oh, good job. Oh, but his journey here has not been easy, starting with a difficult diagnosis soon after he was born. It's a genetic disorder, so it falls under the neuromuscular category, and it's called spinal muscle atrophy, which we call SMA. Honestly, like the worst things you'd ever want to hear. Um, without treatment, most kids don't live past two years old. And then one thing followed another. First hospital mission was in April. In September was when he was hospitalized for his collapsed lung. And then in November, he got sick. He had um, rhino enteral. <coughs> and that kind of just put him down for the count. Thank you. The first promising news for Marshall, a $3 million cutting edge gene therapy. <laughs> giving him and his family optimism to battle the muscular disorder. Rumor has it he's worth more than Taylor Swift. <laughs> yeah. This has given them, you know, a whole new set of opportunities that they wouldn't have had otherwise. And conversations that we're having with families five years ago, we weren't having. Even three years ago, we weren't having without gene therapy. <laughs> and with the care of the nursing and medical so staff at Akron Children's Hospital. Bye, buddy. He doesn't even build such close relationships with the families, you know what I mean? And like, we're here, so I see some of these people more than I see my own family sometimes. On Tuesday, it was time for Marshall to go home. Put his little shoes on him. The most popular man on the seventh floor. And I'm so happy that they're going home and they can start to just live a normal life with their little toddler. He and his family given an emotionally charged farewell. Yeah! So it's definitely going to be a change of pace, but I'm so excited to go home. Hi, thank you. Finally, time to go home. In Akron, Dave Nethers, Fox 8 News.